Hello my wonderful pair of birds and welcome back to another episode of the 100 Baby Challenge. As you can tell, Shelly is looking stunning, but that is because she has not been pregnant for a age at the moment. <laughs> yeah, that can't be happening, it's the 100 Baby Challenge, she's meant to be pregnant. We did move William out in the last episode only because I finally realised, you know, um, it's called the 100 Baby Challenge for a reason and we are only on number 17 and that's only because we have occult babies. So in this episode, we are going to pursue Daryl. I had her doing a little bit of flirtation with him off camera. So we've got our flirt get level doing. So we're going to have her bring him over. We have to have our first kiss before we can do the first woohoo. But our flirt level is amazing. Um, the house that I've been building off camera for the new 100 baby house, um, it was costing like 70,000 simoleons. But I removed all of the furniture in it except for the fitted kitchen. And we can bring all of the beds and stuff with us from our house. But I'm hoping by the end of this episode we will be able to move into that. So we can start next week with a fresh household and a fresh gameplay. So let's get into this episode. Okay. So I'm going to press play. I'm just going to let her go and ring Daryl and get him over. Alright, he'll be right over. Okay. But he'll probably end up uh, across the street or something. Where are you, doll? Okay. All of the kiddos are in bed. Um, which is awesome. I did turn this into kind of a dark-themed kind of vampire room. Because all of the Todds in here right now are actually um, Caleb's kids. And they're all vampire kids. Okay. Where is Caleb? Uh, not Caleb. Daryl. He should be over Daryl, where are you? Do not be down at the beach. Oh, uh, come on. Ooh, what is this? Why is there like a purple... Scared? Is this a new emoji? Um, talk to the monster under your bed. You're fine. Um, Daryl, you need to kind of come before... Um, he never came. He just said he was coming and then he never came. Um, from people, person, lifestyle. Alright, he said he'd be right over. Okay. Really? Daryl? Don't make me summon your butt here. Okay, so we're just going to do that now. We're just going to... Uh, Alright, what is it? Summon Sim. Okay, Daryl will be right here. Okay, I did summon him. He has to come. So, freaking, freaking, freaking come. She's looking great, guys, isn't she? Oh my god, freaking heck, Daryl. Isn't he just a... Uh, Summon. Okay. Where are you? Oh my god, he's here. Pause. Okay. Hi, Daryl. How are you, Daryl? Okay, let's go and beguile this man. Okay. He's got a nice bod. Are you taller than him? Oh my god, I'm taller than him? Okay, he must be a freaking tiny man. Okay, do your first kiss. Do your first kiss. And that's how it's done, guys. That's how it's done. Oh, excuse me, guys. Okay, so next thing is, let's get this man and file for a baby. Let's go deal with our kitties, they're scared. What is happening? Are these lights not working anymore? Hide under the covers. Um, hide under the covers. <laughs> and, um, 
Jamaica, you go hide under the covers as well. <laughs> I don't know how to fix this. But I do want my Todd's all to go back to sleep. Okay, go sleep. It is very late. You all need to go to sleep. Um. Oh, I, oh my god, it won't let me do anything. Um. Talk to the monster under the bed. Uh, or Shelly, are you better being there making moves? You are. Okay, Louise was unsuccessful. Can you come and spray the monster under the bed for your kiddos? And then you can take a pregnancy test. Cool. These kids are all running into their mom or Daryl or whoever. <laughs> um, what's that scary noise? Is there something under the bed? Is this part of a new, um, the paranormal pack, is it? Okay, hopefully that's going to fix things for our kids. We're pregnant. We're pregnant. Dar -ar -ar. Oh, we're pregnant. Okay. All right. So that was my aim. We are gonna have we're pregnant with baby number eighteen. Um. Yeah, we're pregnant with number baby number eighteen. We can't have any more than one because we still have the full house now. Okay. So, girl, stop going to play at the dollhouse. You are going to. Ask Daryl just to be friends. There we go. Okay. Alright. So I'm going to make sure that some of this stuff has been moved into the inventory. It's mad we have tree vampire babies. All our birth certificates have to come with us. Now, one of the things I do want to get is um, a camera. I want her to be able to take pictures with all our kids. We can invite them all over one by one. All right, I want to bring all of the kids' artwork. Uh, what else? Okay. Um, the beds. And we need all of our... We're going to do up a vampire room. And a wizard room as well. We're going to upload a lot of load of rooms. Okay, we need the potties and we need the bricks. Um, I'll make sure the potties are here. Come on. We've, yeah, we have three potties. Um, there we go. Jamaica's responsibility is in range to earn their own responsibility, Trish. Okay, you need to be in there. Okay. Uh, have I got anything I can grab in, drag into my inventory? All right, cards and stuff. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, we've got more cards. We've got these little guys. From when we went to that festival. Okay, I've got more here. Any more pictures the kids did? Uh, that's all the pictures. Okay. Right, so we'll go to your build mode. Um, I want to bring all the beds. I'm going to get rid of that light because it's not really a light. It's some work. Find the object, are you for real? Okay. Right, okay, that all got then I'm gonna bring the tables and our TV and our fridge and our matching oven and 
essential everything we need this thing now because I have got a fitted kitchen um, I'll pop the counters back there we don't need the counters and um, bring in all the tables and artwork okay and I know these don't actually have bed frames but um, they were cheap and that's all that's I'm just gonna defend that <laughs> right they were cheap okay so the dollhouse comes with us and all of the teddy bears and then of course we bring in Neve's headstone with us and we bring in our easels with us um, what else have we got right all the artwork is coming with us I don't care okay well, on our mats and our curtains okay and the bed which it won't let me bring okay it won't let me ring because apparently it's it's already there in the, the, the inventory somewhere oh we got more blocks here okay is that everything am i forgetting any oh we need the art table and this thank you i think that is everything um oh we have this apparently it's not there it's it's just saying it's not there um, oh, we're bringing another one of these with us, and these are obviously for the baby room. Okay, the house is freaking empty. Okay. Mm. Okay. <sighs> All right. Um, we are moving at four fifteen in the morning. So let's um move household check toddler okay um kids are all like very like she is playful but she was scared she's sick of being your stinky diaper <laughs> oh god we're doing it we're doing it okay we should be able to afford this now we've got over 30 grand and if we sell that okay so i'm just moving our stuff in it taking out the yellow stuff and putting in our pink stuff okay um I already have this the little chairs and stuff here so I'm gonna get rid of the ones we brought I didn't have them in the other house did I all right cool um where am I gonna set up the little play area okay um let's put the dollhouse here Ooh, that's map all right that's the right size for the dollhouse isn't it okay um for now, I'm just going to say this is a little lounge area till we get some proper couches and stuff. My little boho area. <laughs> um, we can make the TV bigger. I don't mind that too much. And then we put our little owl chair here. Okay, so in the kitchen, this whole wall area I kind of left open for this guy. This is a pop art kick in here. Do we have anything else in there? I don't think we did. Ooh, our mailbox. <laughs> there we go. Kids are all outside. Like, let us in, let us in. We want to see our new house too. And I'm just like, you may wait because um, I need to furnish it <laughs> with stuff from your house, but like, I still need to furnish it. Um, okay. So in here is our little toddler room. Um, I used a lot of the pre-made rooms, but we're kind of going to make them our own. This little area here had like little chairs and stuff and a TV, but we're going to leave the TV viewing for out here in the family room. And in here, we're going to just kind of have our bear and our potties. And some of these lights because Frick knows that they um all they ever have is nightmares. Um okay, so dining area. I'm gonna pop it there. I know we have that area there, but um I want like a proper kind of dining area where they all sit as a family, sit around the table, do their homework. Things like that. Who doesn't want that? 
Now down here it's going to be the kids room and we go upstairs and um, we've got two rooms upstairs at the moment. I want the larger one to be um, Shelly's. So how many kids have we got right now? We have, oh god I can't remember. We have four kids I think because they're all um, here and we should actually have enough room for four beds. Okay, I think we do. Um, we do not need a double door. Kids do not need a freaking double door unless I move that over there. And we pop this other bed here. They should all get their own little side tables now and this, there should be room for study area. Did I do a uh, room for study area? Okay, oh, well, we've got enough room there for two tables. Um, actually, I'm just, a whole wall in the kids' room for study time, okay? Right, there has to be a way, like, this is, oh, this is freaking annoying me. Um, okay, where's the chairs? Okay. One, two, three, four. Good. The other one goes back in to inventory. Right, okay. Um, unless I do it this way a wall of just beds down the wall. Thank you. Um, okay. Um, three. It's gonna be more freaking there. Do we need this hall at all? No, we don't. Which means what? We can enlarge the room. Foundation requires a room. Not really. There we go. And just get this simple, 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 simple. There we go. Alright. We're done. Okay, there we go. So move you in one, move you over one. And there should be room, of course, for another bed. There you go. It's not a lot of space, but this is fine. Okay, this is fine. We got this, we got this. Okay. And we can fit in another desk. There we go. Yeah. I'm happy with that. Right, mattresses, where are you? Okay, one. Oh, why do I keep doing this? Two. Three. Four. Okay. And let's, okay. One. Two. Three. And let's put some art pieces. Okay. Da, 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 da. have some mats in here. It's gonna really just kind of um, make the room a bit more vibey if you know what I mean. Just because everything is so squished together doesn't mean it doesn't have to be pretty. Okay now here we go we have our toddler room so one, two, three, but if the toddlers have more room than the kids do, and I don't know if that's right. <laughs> but um, I don't know. I kind of have a feeling that the kids should have the bigger room, and the tods should have the smaller room. But um, the tods wouldn't know what to do with a smaller kind of bedroom, so I don't really want to push my luck. Okay, 
Um, have we got a back door? We do have a back door. Um, I want to kind of make a vibey zone for um, Neve. So let's just kind of. Alright. Now I want like a big circle. Like that. Where that's the only area where grass grows because our girl Neve is there. And then we can. As time goes on, we could just kind of like grow some trees around her. Right, I'm gonna put three on around her now. There we go. All right? That's perfect for now. Right, this whole downstairs area is fine. I just want to pop Shelly's bed in now, and we can just kind of finish the room. Um, I'll finish the room off camera. I'll finish the whole place off camera, but um, for now I just kind of wanna get into a little bit of game.